1 for each of the following equation relating x and y if the rate of change of x is 2 unit per second. So you see here this one is in term of second. So rate of change of x this one is dx over dt. Why? Because over time. You see here 2 unit per second dx over dt is 2. Find the rate of change of y at the given instant. So you see here this one is dy of dx over dt. So what the question 1 rate of change of y is dy over dt. Okay. So how to do this? So here we have. So here we have dy over dx is equal to. You see this one is dy right. So this one is also dy. This one is over dt. Because what we wanted to find is dt. So if this one is dt. This one must be dt over dx. So can you see here. So, because why t and t can be cancelled out. So, this one is the same with this. So, here dy over dt. So, when you want dy over dt, you want here you change this to other side. So, dy over dx divide by dt over dx. So, you see here division of fraction is equal to dy over dx multiplied by dx over dt. So you have to find this one, you have to find this one. After you find out these two, you can find your dy over dt. So here a, y is equal to 3x square minus 4. So dy over dx is equal to, when we differentiate this, 2 times 3, we get 6. So x, 2 minus 1 is 1. So we get 6x. So we have dy over dx. So here... We have dx over dt is equal to, so dx over dt is equal to 2. So this one dy over dt is equal to dy over dx is this one 6x times dx over dt is given 2. And we know that x is equal to half. When x is equal to half, dy over dt is equal to 6. This one is substitute half times 2. So this one is 3 so 3 times 2 is 6 so here the rate of change of y as a given instant is 6 or 6 units per second all right so here b so y is equal to 2 x square plus 1 over x so, x is equal to 1. So, again, we wanted the question 1, dy over dt. Just use this formula. I mean, I explain in A, if you just skip any question, uh, take a look at question A, where I explain this one. Okay, so, this one, dy over dx is equal to. So, you see here, when you differentiate, the x cannot be down here. It needs to be up. So, here, y is equal to 2x square plus x negative 1. When you differentiate 2x square, 2 times 2, we get 4x. 2 minus 1 is 1, just x. And when we differentiate this one, negative 1 times 1, because in front of x is actually 1, we get negative x. And negative 1 minus 1, you get negative 2. So you get 4x minus x negative 2 is actually 1 over x2. So here when x is equal to 1, so you see this one x is equal to 1. So dy over dx is equal to 4 1 minus 1 over 1 square which is equal to 4 minus 1 which is equal to 3. So now we have our dy over dx. So dx over dt we also have. So dy over dt is equal to dy over dx times dx over dt. So dy over dx is 3 dx over dt is 2. So here we get 6. So this one is 6 units per second. So C y is equal to 2 over 3x minus 5 is 1. x is equal to 2. So we have to find our dy over dx first. So the, form, the power cannot be down. So this one is 3x minus 5, this one will become negative. So here dy over dx is equal to negative 3 times 2, we get negative 6. So when we have this one bracket with power, don't touch anything inside the bracket first. Okay, so this one negative 3 minus 1, we get negative 4, right? 
then only you can differentiate what is inside the bracket. So here we have negative 6, 3x minus 5, negative 4. So when we differentiate 3x, we get 3. Differentiate this one, we get 0. So this one, we get negative 18. So you see here, power of negative 4, we can bring it down to become 3x minus 5, power of 4. So this one is the equation. So we know that cx is equal to 2. So when x is equal to 2, dy over dx is equal to negative 18 divided by 3 times 2 minus 5 power of 4. So this one negative 18. So this one is 8 minus 3 times 2 is 6. 6 minus 5 is 1 power of 4. So we get negative 18. So we see here this one is negative 18. This one is dy over dx. dy over dx we got dx over dt is given so dy over dt is equal to dy over dx is negative 18 time dx over dt is given which is 2 so here we get negative 36 so this one is negative 36 units per second so dy is equal to 4x minus 3 power of 5 so this one x is equal to half so dy over dx is equal to when you have bracket is with power first you just uh, differentiate first don't touch inside the bracket first so 5 bring forward we get 5 4x minus 3 and then we minus the power with 1 5 minus 1 is 4 only then we differentiate what is inside the bracket this one so here we have 5 4x minus 3 power of 4 when we differentiate 4x we get 4 differentiate negative 3 we get 0 so 4 times 5 we get 20 4x minus 3 power of 4 so this one is dy over dx so we know that our x here is half so when x is equal to half dy over dx is equal to 20 4 times half minus 3 power of 4 this one is 20 4 times half is 2 2 minus 3 power of 4 this one is you see here anything power with even number you will get a positive value so this one is 1 so you get 20 so we know that dy over dx is equal to 20 so dy over dt is equal to dy divided by dx which is 20 right we get the value already times dx over dt is given which is 2 so here we get 40 so this one is in units per second so e we have y is equal to x over x plus 1 so here you cannot just uh, divide like that you can use quotient rule so dy over dx is equal to v du over dx minus u dv over dx divided by v square. So here, the up here is u and below here is v. So u is equal to x, du over dx is equal to 1. When you differentiate x, you get 1. So your v is x plus 1. So dv over dx, when you differentiate x plus 1, you also get 1. Okay, so just substitute inside the formula, your V is X plus 1, DU over DX is 1, minus your U is X, your DV over DX is 1, divided by V square. So V square is X plus 1 square. So when you uh, expand this, X times 1 is X, 1 times 1 is 1, X times 1 is minus X divided by x plus 1 square so x minus x is 0 so 1 divided by x plus 1 square this one is your dy over dx equation but it's given here that your y is equal to 2 so you see here instead of giving x is giving y so you have to find what is your x so that you can substitute inside here But from y, you, you are given equation y is equal to x over x plus 1. If you are given the value of y, then you can find your x when you substitute the value of y. So when y is equal to 2, x divided by x plus 1. So you bring to the other side. 2 times x is 2x. 1 times 2 is 2 is equal to x. So you bring x at the other side. 
2x minus x is x and you bring 2 to the other side you get x is equal to negative 2 this one x is equal to negative 2 so here when x is equal to negative 2 dy over dx is equal to 1 divided negative 2 plus 1 square which is 1 divided by negative 1 square so you get everything you see here power with even number is positive value so 1 divided by 1 is 1 so dy over dx is equal to 1 so dy over dt dy over dt is equal to dy over dx which is equal to 1 time d, dx over dt which is given 2 so here we get 2 this one is 2 units per second So f y is equal to x cubed plus 2. So dy over dx is equal to, you bring 3 forward, so 3x, 3 minus 1 is 2. When you differentiate 2, you get 0. So this one is your dy over dx. So we know that here, we don't have your x, but you have our y. So we know that y is equal to x cubed plus 2. So here, when y is equal to 10, 10 is equal to x cubed plus 2. So we bring to the other side, x cubed is equal to 10 minus 2, which is equal to 8. S is equal to cube root of 8, which is equal to 2. So here we know that x is equal to 2. So when x is equal to 2, your dy over dx is equal to 3, 2 square, which is 3 times 4, which is equal to 12. So you get already your dy over dx. So you see here dy over dx we already got. DY, dx over dt is given. So we can find your dy over dt which is equal to dy over dx is 12 time dx over dt is given to. So you get 24. This is 24 units per second. Right.